All right, guys, welcome back. Um, yes, my glasses are still kind of messed up, and I can't really see, but uh, they just announced that <laughs> they're opening my casino next Friday. Um, they said that they were going to do a phase, monitor it, do a phase. They literally opened everything in a span of three weeks, and with the protests and everything going on, and we have nine other states that have continued to have daily increases and hospitalizations, and they're just gonna just like, like we're one of the lowest states in like cases, but like uh, it's just we were supposed to be phase three, and they just opened us in phase two. I'm not happy, um, so I'm just gonna have to push through this blurriness until my new glasses come in and just crank out some videos before I have to go back to work. It sucks. I'm not looking forward to it. I don't want to go back. The casino is literally the worst place. I've seen all the photos, all the videos of like Vegas and how nobody's following protocols, nobody's social distancing, nobody's wearing masks. Like it's just a mess. And that there hasn't been enough data to to see, you know, if, if the cases are gonna rise from it. They're automatically gonna rise from it. They just said that uh, the, the National Guard members in DC, which is not even an hour from me, who were, um, you know, helping during the protests started, as of today, testing positive for the virus. But they're not telling us how many are testing positive, which, if it was a low number, they'd be like, oh yeah, like two or three people got it, blah, blah, blah. So that kind of worries me. But here we are. Those protests are going to be huge spikes. And if you let those people just... Like, gamblers don't care. They're dirty. You're telling me every 30 seconds I gotta touch their chips, I gotta touch their money. I don't care if there's plexiglass in front of me. Like, ugh. I'm not looking forward to it. I wish my YouTube career would take off a little faster. But, uh, that's not gonna happen. Ponkichi is who we're racing at the moment. But, yeah, I'm just... I don't... My wife found another job. Uh, she had an interview today, hopefully. Um, they hire her. I've been looking for more like low exposure, low risk jobs. Oh, we got a team leader already? Oh, look at that bad boy. Lemon flavor. Neo Unlimited. Lemon flavor. Alright. Godzilla versus a freaking Supra. Oh, he's just getting wheels. Well, see you, bud. Alright, car, jeez. Did he hit? Weird. I'm keep the boost on. Because I feel like he's gonna fly up. And, you know, we'll turn it down. They cut off pretty quickly, huh? It's a super. They have higher top speed than me. Here we go. Hit that guy. Hit that truck. Hit him. Oh boy. Come on, baby. Yeah, yeah. Back it off. Back it off. Come on, brother. Let's go. Oh, we got here. Oh, Sanjushi arrival. Okay. Oh, I popped some ibuprofen, hoping that I wouldn't really get too much of a headache, but uh, it's creeping in. All right, so they arrived, but you know what? We're gonna go story time real quick. Tempest Devil. Yeah, I'm just, I'm not happy. I'm not a happy camper. I just feel like casinos, they opened it way faster than they said they were going to. It's just not, ugh. Anyway. Um, Ponkichi. Shokichi Honda, temporary employee. Information is treasure. As soon as something happens on the highway, it somehow immediately reaches his ears, but has a long career in the area, but does not participate too aggressively in battles. 
Data regarding the highway is absorbed into his brain. Of course, he instigates everything from the cars to performance and any weak points. The speed with which he updates data is stunningly quick. Party Drius. Yoshiro Morikawa, store manager. It is meaningless, if not conspicuous. His street name originates from his flashy arrow part. Furthermore, since he says these parts are original creations, it is difficult to look down on them with disdain. Compared with the exterior appearance, his driving is plain, almost eerily so. Apart from the aero parts, his tuning is fairly basic, such as an increase in turbine capacity and adjustment of car height. Thursday. Koichi Minami Sport Shop Clerk. Chance is necessary. He got his street name from the fact that something always happens when one drives with him, that something is not necessarily always bad things, and so there are many who choose to drive with him. His basic concerns are driving and tuning. However, on Thursdays, he exhibits especially rough driving by using a carbon clutch. He has enhanced the response of gear changes. Kazutaro Narajima, confectionery wholesaler. Concentration. He loves driving from the core. Formerly being a long-distance truck driver, due to circumstances, he had to quit his driving job, and now he is fully ensnared in the world of high-speed battle. In his truck driving days, he was famous for his rough driving style, but since he entered the tune world, he's become somewhat tame. But there's power in his little by little encroaching style. Nagia Hitachi, poet, the road never ends. He published a compilation of poems which came to mind as he battled. It was received with rave reviews from drivers, but sales are not that great because it's difficult for the general public to understand. He has created a powerful machine. Also, he has a problem-solving strategy with a large intercooler as far as his driving. He takes advantage of his FR footwork and he prides himself in cornering. Osi Kajia, college student. It's all about driving. He never once thought to win, but he was a veteran that always won. He loves to drive more than anything else, but women, not as much. So he is appalled by the leader's constant skirt chasing. The engine is a 7M type and gives the feeling of seeming to roll about all over the place, but he has accomplished a large increase in power, but uses a lightweight propeller shaft, increasing the direct feel. Lemon flavor. Look at that thing, man. Uh, Sugaharo Katu Sportmaker, noun lover. <laughs> in the past, he belonged to Unlimited, but not being able to go along with the team's philosophy, he left. He gathered about people that really loved to drive and formed a team. His driving is exhilarating, not giving any sense of the car's body size. The secret is the thoroughly strengthened undercarriage and lightening of weight. As far as for the engine, response is the important concern. All right. Well, that was really difficult. Yeah, come to find out, um, when I had these lenses replaced, the lady was like, oh, I straightened your frames out. So instead of the glasses having like a slight curve, she made them so it was like that. And it completely, you know, you move, it completely throws everything off. So I tried to like bend them back myself and like, I'm, I was tired of going back because they already scratched my lenses once and then they did this and like, I just went to a new eye doctor. So it's just a matter of waiting for my stuff to get in. But it is what it is. Um, this is the team that just came in, huh? The one gone out. Let's go to Yokohama. Let's finish those in, in, okay, in it is. Yeah, I might not be able to do this too much longer. Okay, so it's going this way. This is tough, hard to focus. It's crazy how like the littlest adjustments just makes it so you can't freaking see anything. Sucks, man. But I can't just go like a week without, a week, week and a half without posting videos. Can't do that. A Scion XB, come on, man. My eyes are burning right now. Burn it. Oh. Magic Master. See, bud. I'm like <laughs> squinting so hard just to like focus on game like I'm not even I don't even know <laughs> can't even talk out I guess we're going to get that blue guy up there huh where you at bud hello 
the hell? There he is. Alright, who we got? Who we got? Ba da ba ba ba. Uh, cool Haruchi. Okay. Sorry, I can't see. I'm blind. <laughs> supposed, to, supposed to be all right to just a bow. Hey, bud. $560,000. Wow. Can't even get like one more in here. One, one more race. One more, dude. Nothing. Right. Jeez. Alright guys, unfortunately I think I'm gonna hmm literally have one more guy on big wave on APS. Uh, I'm struggling here with these glasses. I'm gonna go take them off and I guess play my switch because I literally can't do anything. Freaking sucks man. Um yes I, at least I got one episode out, right? Freaking sucks man. Um, yeah, we'll go ahead and buy a new car soon when we have enough money. Um, probably gonna get the Supra. But anyway, guys, uh, if you haven't already, hit the subscribe button. Um, I don't know if you guys have seen the Dirt 5 news. The career looks pretty insane. Um, looks promising. Looking forward to that. I'll probably do some Dirt Rally 2.0 after we finish this series because <laughs> almost two years and I have yet to play it. Um, so yeah, anyway, if you missed any of the other episodes, playlist down in the description, and I will see you guys on the next one.